directly. It's a link. E. Hollywood Vanny. What do you got? Um. Gotta get the R2D2 sound. Hey, what's up, guys? I'm Manny on the streets. As you can see, my job basically consists of where all the hot spots are. I find my locations on how many times we've been to that city, how many people email us, basically. Um, what I do is I look at the calendar to see what prizes I'm giving out for the day, make sure I have all those prizes, and if not, I coordinate with my man, Chris Martinez. What's up, everybody? My name is Chris Martinez. I am Manny on the Street segment producer for On Air with Ryan Seacrest. Monday through Fridays, you know how we do it. Uh, a lot of people want to know what I do for a job. People just don't realize I just don't drive Manny around. Regular people! A lot of people think that, but I don't. So uh, I go through the calendar, I go ahead and make sure everything's booked right. You know, I correspond with sales. A lot of it's uh, touch and go, especially with our stuff, because we get a lot of clients that hit us up to do stuff. There's a section on our board, what we have in studio, where it says where Manny's gonna be and what prize he's giving away. So it's my job to go ahead and update that daily and make sure it's on time, because if a jock sees that and it's not updated, they can go ahead and read the wrong thing in the wrong city. And that's the last thing that we want, because then that will just confuse our listeners. Basically, I would give Ryan one call on my way there to tell him what prizes I have, where I'm at. In Hollywood. Ryan's Rose is coming up in just a few. Also, Slee's next. And Manny is on his way to Fountain Valley in the Roach Coach this morning. Manny on the streets. If you want him to come to your neighborhood, email us, Ryan at kissfm.com. But Manny, what do you have in the back of the Roach Coach today? I will give him a call again to reveal the location. I don't want to give away the location while I'm on the way there because people will get there and I'm not even there yet. And they're like, where's Manny? So that's why we do the two calls. And then, of course, the big payoff with all the listeners. You know, uh, it's not just me and Manny in the morning. A lot of people do think that, but we do have a third person. He's our Roach Coach driver. His name is George. Uh, he comes out every day. He meets us uh, at a different spot. Well, he's actually in a different spot in the morning. He's never in the morning with us up until about 6 o'clock, 7 o'clock in the morning. That's when we meet up with George. He drives the Roach Coach. That thing is just huge. I could not maneuver it myself. Neither could Manny. The great thing about being Manny on the streets is, of course, the listeners. Yeah. I love taking pictures with them, love signing their autographs. They listen to us every single day. You know, Ryan can't be out and about meeting the people, so I am an extent for now. of Ryan. I mean, I look like Ryan, Kiss FM. but Manny on I'm the streets. Boy, He's in Fountain Valley live right now, the 405 and Warner Avenue exit. Manny. We are live in Fountain Valley. Everybody say hi, Ryan. Word up. Lots of people here, man, getting their Famima gift cards, High School Musical 3, Pep Rally tickets, and Phineas Ferb DVDs. I got Deepa here. Who's your shout-out to? Hi, my shout-out is to my daughters, Kayla and Krishma, and my son, Rishi. And thanks, Ryan. Also got Janaya here. Who's your shout-out to? My shout-out to my ex. Thanks, Ryan, for all you've done. I should have been on your Ryan's road this. <laughs> <laughs> the corner of Warner Avenue and Bouchard, off the 405 Famima store right here in Fountain Valley. I'm Manny on the streets, and you're on air with Ryan Seacrest on 2.7 Kiss. Hey, the Hey, ever seen a shave it with the butterfly? How did your event went today? Uh, it went all right. I mean, except for that lady. The what? contact. Woo! Same one from last week, right? Same one from last week. She was. Did you hear what I was saying to her? Yeah, oh, thank, thank you. you. So much. Thank you. Awesome. No problem. Are they posted in the up that we're going there? Or? No, only on the only way you guys are doing on there. Oh, okay. Because a couple of listeners came up to us and they said that they were told that we'd be here from eight to nine. It was that lady and her kid. Yeah, it was just well, like miscommunication. Most of the job consists of customer service. Somebody in the store uh, posted up that we were supposed to be here from eight to nine. And then that's why a couple people got here late and were like, well, where's my stuff? It's cool if you posted up that we're going to be there that day. I'm um, like, if anything, just put morning. They're only guaranteed two calls. Traveling with Manny is something else. Car discussions with Chris. This is how I get into his brains. Yeah. What Saved by the Belt alumni? Mark Paul Dawson. No, that's not even the answer. Can you wait? It's uh, very unique, I can tell you that. There's never a dull moment with uh, myself and Manny. You know, he has a family and he has to go ahead and try to play Super Dad and, and Super Manny and try to do everything, try to balance out everything. I don't know how he does it because he's in the car with me more than half a day. And then we have a world premiere tonight for the house bunny. So all of that is just constantly on the go, go, go. Stuttering Stanley, stuttering Stanley, stuttering Stanley. And that's only the beginning of the day. 
We still got a whole day left to go. And now it's off to the world premiere of the House Bunny, where I'm gonna be talking to a couple celebs. So check it out. If I could describe our day in one word, chaotic. If I could sum up this job in one word, it would be busy. How many on the streets? I'm gone.